Dun, 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 dun. Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to Sunrise at Nell Shabby Free Camp. This place is awesome. You have to come and stay here if you stay around here anyway. Uh, today, we're going to go back down to Port Broughton, see what it's like on a nicer day. It's going to be so perfect, and there's no wind. And uh, yeah, last time we were there, it was a bit disappointing. And yeah, that's what we're doing. Ooh, what are you doing? Making my weird tea. Weird teas, eh? Yeah. Ooh, oh. yeah. Oh yeah, that's a bit I just weird. Just got my looking. green tea and I mix my turmeric and pepper in it. Yeah. Pepper helps you absorb turmeric better. Hot tip. Yeah. So, Interesting. Yeah. And cold tea, hey? Yeah, we do cold tea now. <laughs> cause, yeah, cause it's easier and cause like, we think I was overdoing the hot tea and like burning my stomach, so. Yeah, and cold tea is just so much easier, and it just I'm just like, well, because I like what I was doing is I was having hot tea because that was just what people do, but then it, I don't really like it hot anyway, so I'd like let it sort of half cool down anyway, and then it's sort of like, what are we doing? Why don't I just have a cold? Hmm. So I do. There you go. Fascinating. Cold, <laughs> weird, turmeric, peppery tea. It's what Sarah's about. <laughs> so why is it here? I gotta show you these people's wombat over here, man. If I can get a sponsor, this is the place we want to sponsor us. <laughs> over here, hiding in the trees, mate, is this sick sunliner wombat. Look at this, the sunliner habitat. And uh, oh man, look at the wheels on it. It's like heavy duty as. I've never seen one so heavy duty or one that I liked so much. I reckon they got motorbikes in the back of this thing even. Oh man, and she's on the big eye Veco. Oh, what a beast. Man, if Sunliner want to build us like the wombat habitat, that would be the sickest camper. I could come and help them do it. I'd love to come and build one as well. Eh? Let me in the factory and we'll build it. And then we'll go touring and uh, yeah, take your wombat everywhere. we got to give a quick shout out to uh, Rowan and his mum. There's been like a stray cat living here. So they help, they asked me to help catch it, and then they packed it straight up. They're going to take it into the vet, get it checked out, and uh, try and find it a home. And it will. It's this cool little kitten. I wish I got some footage. But uh, his mum's actually walking like 6,000 Ks across Australia. Their thing's called Trek to Reconnect with a 2. And uh, I'll show you the sticker on the side of their van. But they're not here. They've taken off on me, and now I can't like put them in. So, yeah, have a look anyway. So apparently you can like win their camper. So if you want to buy tickets for their camper, and uh, it all goes to a charity, but I couldn't tell you what charity at the moment. But yeah, that's them. Look them up. And uh, I don't know if this will help you, but uh, give that a go if you can. And yeah, apparently you could win this mad Jayco Swift beast. But yeah. That was really cool that they took the cat and they're going to try to find it a home. And uh, yeah, it's really cool they're walking across Australia to raise money. Hey, well, wow, what a mission. <laughs> Welcome back to Port Broughton. Uh, we're going to go check out the bakery for breakfast again. Um, if you didn't see the last video here, go check it out. We went in the Port Broughton time machine and it was awesome. Uh, after we have something to eat, then we're going to go back down to the wharf and hopefully try and catch some fish. I've heard that uh, you can catch uh, yellowfin tuna here. They come through in schools and stuff. And man, I'd love to get a tuna, even if it's only like this big, that'd be sick. So uh, yeah, we'll see how we go today. Whoa, the wombat. Oh wow, check out this thing here, man. <laughs> like what? A Nissan Titan. I never ever seen nothing like it. What a beast. Why would you buy one of them Dodge Ram things when you can have that? Wow. Oh man, that's sick. Wow. Wow, man, it's huge. Who knew Nissan made something like that? Oh, and it doesn't even have a Nissan engine in it. Big Cummins, man. Wow. Holy moly. What a beast. Who knew? Oh man, what a beast. So our mate said it's like 16 years old. It's not even brand new, but you'd think it was. Uh, imported from America, 
converted to Australian and uh, yeah, wow, oh man, I want that. Oh man, how good is the bakery here? Broughton Bakery, it's amazing. Oh yeah man, check out the, the best cheese and feta rolls we've had. My mm. sausage roll looks like it's going to be awesome. Oh, I need this cake man. Oh, like, their cakes are Oh, you should best. feel it. Like, th it's going to be so good. Mm. And then look at this pack of donuts we got. $3.50 man. Half price because they're yesterday's. Oh yeah, but they're still good. But gonna... they're still so good. Like, oh, the cake wow. we got. The way, just the way they like... feel, you can tell they're going to be awesome. Oh, yum, yum, yum. Mmm, man, you got to come here, Port Broughton Bakery, check out the time machine next door, <laughs> oh yeah, go back watch the other video, it's pretty funny. How's <laughs> yours? Oh, amazing. Yeah, oh wow, man, it's so good here. And like, I think all that cost us 20 bucks. Bargain. And oh, that cake is just going to be so delicious. Oh, yeah. Based on the cake we had last oh, week. Man. Oh man, I can't wait to eat the cake. That's going to be mad. Thanks. Bye. All right. What just happened? Oh, I've got to send him like details for drawing up the contract. He was saying too, I was real lucky. He said there was like not much in the office, so it sounds like I've basically just yeah. pitched someone. Contracts so. for what though? For the for the house. Okay. For the house. So we just bought a house at Port Perry. Yay! Can't wait. Go in there and fix it up and uh, put some runners in and uh, it's going to be mad and then we yeah. can keep going and yeah. Oh, how awesome is this? Yeah, oh man. Exciting as. Oh, and we get to buy a car now. Yeah. Now we're going to yeah. go buy a runabout. So I think we'll go do that now instead of going fishing. Yep, yep, sounds yeah, good. let's go get our car. Let's mad. Alright, so that was a quick stop at uh, Port Broughton. Now we're heading back to Port Perry. Go look at this car, and uh, we're going to show you the house we bought. Right, so here's the little beast we come to see. And uh, yeah, she's 2005 Lancer VRX wagon. It's in the best colour they come in. The interior's really nice in there. The aircon all works good. Uh, yeah, I think this is us, eh? Take her for a test drive, and uh, we will know for sure. Little bit of faded yellow, but like you're going to get that in South Australia. Same as the bonnet, but I can tidy all that up. And she'd be sweet. You like him? I like him. Right, so uh, here we are test driving our little car now. And uh, yeah, I think we're going to take it. Um, Lancer? Yeah, it's sporty. Yeah, it's the steering is so like sensitive and like precise and the brakes are all awesome. <laughs> She's mad. The cars are good. We <laughs> locked them up. The guy over there is looking like... <laughs> Oh yeah, nah, she's great. I think everything works good. I think we'll take um, it. She does what I'd expect. Yeah, love the really dark tint too. Eh? Mm. All the cars in South Australia have like darker tint than you'd ever get away they with. They need to with the sun here. Queensland, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so uh, I think this is gonna be like our runabout work you station wagon thing. While so, we're fixing yeah. up the house. We'll uh, have to yeah. run down the bank and get him some money, probably. And uh, then he'll go and put the rego on it. No inspections or nothing in South Australia. It's all really laxy. And uh, yeah, we'll have ourselves a mad little uh, VRX Lancer station wagon. So yeah, sweet. <laughs> uh, we got to go do some shopping. We're just at Audi. And then uh, I'll go down to KFC. They they want, uh, you'll find out another time. But yeah, it's going to be hilarious. Oh man, no way. Remember that wombat we saw this morning? Well, look, check this one out. What? Wow. Oh, this is my new favorite wombat. Oh man, what a beast that is. It, uh, it, it makes our wombat look like it's a road going beast. This, this thing's gonna go anywhere. Wow, oh, beast. All right, so now we've dealt with the filth over there a little bit. Yep, now that you dealt with the filth at KFC. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, KFC. Ah, uh, this is our house. Check it out. Oh, we bought a house. Yeah. How exciting. So, uh, yeah, we got to get in and uh, paint it and get some electrical work done and tidy some stuff up. But uh, she's going to be a beautiful house when we're done. Can't wait to start. It's all going to be really exciting. It's going to be two weeks before we get the keys. Um, 
We'll make it pretty. Yeah, yeah, can't wait. No, no. I don't, we'll make another video about KFC another day if we have to, but we'll see what they do first. Uh, yeah, so this is it, eh? Four bedrooms. It's uh, really cheap. I haven't told you yet because I did them on all you city people coming and stealing our house. <laughs> but uh, yeah, for a four bedroom house, we got five minutes walk to Coles, Woolies, the primary school's over here. The hospital's two minutes down the road there. Like everything is walking distance from here. So uh, I think we've done really, really well. Mm. We've even got like our own Stoby pole it out the front. <laughs> and uh, yeah, if you're looking for cheap real estate, I'd suggest coming and looking at uh, Port Pirie and yep. come and fix a house up. And uh, yeah, break. heaps of jobs, no rentals. It's a good investment. And uh, it's probably not a bad place to live when you retire or something either. But yeah, like Queensland's pretty good too. So anyway, now we're going to go and have lunch and then go pick up our Rally Lancer. It's going to be mad. Oh man, the cars. South Australia is just full of mint old cars. Wow. And it's like Wednesday. It's not even the weekend or nothing. So yeah, we're just here having lunch. We're going to go and pick up our Lancer in a minute. Then uh, we're going to go back to the free camp and probably uh, park the Wombat up there and set it up. And then we've got to come back in the town, sign contracts and do things like that. And uh, yeah, what a day, man. How exciting has it been? And like you've missed out on probably the most exciting bit. Uh, but 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 I will make a video about it all one day. Uh, I just I I just need KFC to sort their stuff out. I don't want to go saying too much bad stuff about them or anything because uh, at the moment some of the people at KFC appear to be trying to help. So we will see what happens. Oh man, mad spot for lunch, eh? And under the big silos. How sick is it? Alright, let's go. Alright, check it out. We got a new baby. Two new babies today. Oh yeah, what a day. So we're not sure what's going to happen with transferring the rego. And how it's going to affect our Queensland regos. If we've got to transfer it into our name. So that's going to be the next part of the story, I guess. And uh go into town after and we'll try to sort that out or maybe tomorrow but we got to go in and uh, sign these contracts when we hear from the real estate too and so like yeah it's all happening <coughs> <coughs> wow choking what an exciting day oh thinking about that kfc too much oh man so it's been a big big day for us so uh we didn't get the sign go and sign the contract. They're just gonna email it to us and we'll do like digital signature and that. So we're just gonna stay here and try and beat the heat because it's uh, 36 something degrees at the moment and it's still it it. like the sun doesn't go down till eight o'clock at night. It's only what, three o'clock or something? No, like four o'clock now. Oh, four o'clock. Yeah. And uh, yeah, so yeah, it's well, gonna get hotter. Yeah. They reckon it's gonna touch 38. So we just gotta beat the heat, but yeah. How cool is our little new car? How and cool our is our new house? house. Where oh, else yeah. can you buy a four bedroom house? Nowhere. For 140,000. Nowhere. I'll tell you, yeah, literally nowhere. Yeah, yeah. So, Where you uh, can like walk to Coles, Woolies, town, it, everything. It, it does need a bit of work, a lot of painting and things. We're going to be here a while fixing it. But yeah, it's like the cheapest house yeah. in, in the suburb and the street. And uh, yeah, we're going to turn it into the best house in the street and the suburb, hopefully. So uh, yeah. you probably get to see a lot of that. I don't know. We'd like, I guess we're just going to add it into this channel. We could make a channel called like Flippin' with Ben and Sarah <laughs> or like yeah. What the Flip or like something's crazy. Like, but like, I don't want to have to do that. We're just going to stick it all here. And uh, yeah, yeah, if you don't want to see we'll that. probably still do little don't... jubbly things in, the, in amongst it. So yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, we got heaps to still see around yeah. here. We got time. We, we can go and explore the York Peninsula now and the peninsula on the other side and everywhere. And yeah, so we'll see what happens. And then uh, we'll see if we can get back to Port Broughton and catch a tuna maybe tomorrow or sure. during the week sometime. There's so much festivals and things going around here as well. So there's oh. heaps, heaps going on. So yep. even if you don't like the house stuff, stick around because like we aren't stopped yet. We're just going to do this place up run it out for a bit and keep traveling and uh we'll see what we do when we finish traveling with it so yeah mad eh 
um, I hope you've enjoyed this one. It's uh, a bit different and yeah, it's going to be exciting. So yeah, we will see you next time. Yeah. Dun, 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 dun.